Knight here. Welcome back to my Dragon Age Origins. Let's play. So, now where do we go? Ah, now I leave. I'm going the wrong way. Again. Do you think the tower is ever going to get back to what it was, Wynn? I don't know. A great number of people died. It will be difficult to imagine rebuilding. Uh, so... Let's head to Redcliffe. Oh, don't tell me it was another fight. <laughs> yep. Uh, why do people like fight? Willingly fight me. Yep, I want to go forward. Yeah, the lights getting further and further, isn't it? Ah, we still haven't moved the bodies and it's been, what, several months in game? <laughs> Hello, Owl. Eamon. I understand you've acquired all the allies you could. That's good. We can call the lands meet if you are ready. I would prefer not giving Logain time to consider, but it is up to you. I do not wish to go to Denerim unless you are with me. Yeah. Excellent. I shall make the arrangements. Let us be off to Denerim, and may the Maker watch over us. Denerim is the heart and soul of Ferelden. It was the city of King Kalanhad, the birthplace of Andraste. As stubborn as a Mabari, and as good to have on your side. If 
If we defeat Loghain here, the rest of the nation will follow us. By calling the Landsmeet, I've struck the first blow. The advantage for the moment is ours. He will have little choice but to show himself, to oppose us directly. He will strike back at us. The only question that remains is how soon. Logan, this is an honor that the Regent would find time to greet me personally. How could I not welcome a man so important as to call every lord in Ferelden away from his estates while a blight claws at our land? The blight is why I'm here. With Caelan dead, Ferelden must have a king to lead it against the Darkspawn. Ferelden has a strong leader. It's queen, and I lead her armies. Um. And who is this, Seaman? Some new stray you picked up on the road? And here I thought it was only royal bastards you played the nursemaid to. Yeah. Well, you're admitting the royal part. That's a start. <laughs> yeah. You have my sympathies on what happened to your order. It is unfortunate that they chose to turn against Ferelden. Oh. Don't interrupt, Churl. Your betters are talking. Enough, Carthian. This is not the time or place. I had hoped to talk you down from this rash course, Eamon. Our people are frightened. Our king is dead. Our land is under siege. We must be united now if we are to endure this crisis. Your own sister, Queen Rowan, fought tirelessly to see Ferelden restored. Would well, you see her work destroyed? You divide our nation and weaken our efforts against the Blight! Your selfish ambitions to the throne! <laughs> Kaelin depended on the Grey Warden's prowess against the Darkspawn, and look how well that ended. Let us speak of reality rather than tall tales. Mm. Stories will not I save us. Well, Logan. I cannot forgive what you've done, Logan. Perhaps the Maker can, but not I. Our people deserve a king of the Theron bloodline. Alistair will be the one to lead us to victory in this blight. Oh, is that all I have to do? No pressure. The Emperor of Orlais also thought I could not bring him down. Expect no more mercy than I showed him. There is nothing I would not do for my homeland. Oh, fun. Well, that was bracing. I didn't expect Loghain to show himself quite so soon. Hmm. Happy day of a long time. My sister married King Merrick while he was still in exile. At that time, he and Loghain were inseparable. The wild prince who'd never seen the inside of a castle and the farmer's son. When Loghain joined Merrick's rebels, he was just a raw-boned boy. But he got on one knee to swear that he would see Ferelden free or die trying. Yeah. Yes, Merrick's mother was the rebel queen. The one who kept the heart of Ferelden beating when so much of it seemed dead. It was a tragedy she never lived to see her son take mm -hmm. her throne. We need eyes and ears in the city. Loghain has been here for months. The roots of all his schemes must begin here. The sooner we find them, the better we can turn them to our advantage. Go have a look around, and see what you can turn up. Better yet, find the nobles who have arrived for the landsmate. Test the waters. See how many will support us. When you're ready to talk strategy, come upstairs to my sitting room. Okay. We can lay out our plans for the landsmate then. Okay. Uh... Okay then, so better leave. Ah. Uh. Yes. Indeed. Yes.
What are you loading exactly? So you met this sibling of yours? Half sister, but yes. And you made a promise to help her? Uh, yes. Dwarven crap. Fine, dwarven crap. This is a parasite from Orzammar. Nothing you do. You know this. It's moments like this when I truly appreciate the difference between you and me. It is moments like this when I truly wonder at the. You're being very foolish. Why would Logain leave half our own army to die when a flight? You're being very foolish. Why would Logan have no time to our own army to die when a flight threatens? Good job clearing those louts out. As I live and breathe, you're the Grey Warden everyone's been talking about. I represent the Blackstone Irregulars. We're a mercenary company that fell on hard times after I the think war. I think it probably goes a bit too late. I'm sure you know that times are getting worse every day. With your help, the Irregulars could be of use to Ferelden once more. The Blackstone Irregulars fought alongside the King's army against Orlais. We've helped nobles defend their land and given our service to people in need for generations. Our current captain, Railnor, is an honorable man who sees that we can do some good in Ferelden once more. He is so confident in our mission that he trusted the Grey Wardens would support us. Okay. Our leaders thought you might be willing to help. Each of our posts in Ferelden will contain letters addressed to you. Unlike most who work with us, you're getting letters straight from Railnor and Tauran, our leaders. I hope this tells you how highly the Irregulars regard the Grey Wardens. Uh. Thank you. When you've completed a mission, just return to me or any of our members stationed at an Irregulars post. We'll make sure your efforts are rewarded. Make us blessings light your path. Okay. Putting this bastard on Marek's throne. It's an ill precedent. What do you suppose Eamon is playing at? Surely he doesn't expect us to believe Anora unfit to rule with her father. I'm sorry, I'm busy at the moment. I see your friendship with the Grey Warden is going very well. Is there a reason you say that with a smirk, elf? I think you know. You and I are not so dissimilar after all. I know what you're doing, lovely woman. And what is it that you think I am doing? Besides the Grey Warden, that is. Biding your time, naturally. As you say. Okay, if I've actually been here. Welcome to the wonders of Thedas. We carry items crafted by the Circle, as well as a variety of antiquities. Is there anything you would like to see? Uh, let's have a look. Be done. <laughs> um, it is begun. The eye lineage is closed. Be on. Ah. Uh. Okay, another battle.
Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna end up in a battle. And so here is the mighty Grey Warden at long last. The crows send their greetings once again. So they sent you, Talison. Or did you volunteer for the job? I volunteered, of course. When I heard that the great Zevran had gone rogue, I simply had to see it for myself. Is that so? Well, here I am, in the flesh. You can return with me, Zevran. I know why you did this, and I don't blame you. It's not too late. Come back, and we'll make up a story. Anyone can make a mistake. Yeah. yeah. And I'm not <laughs> about to let that happen. <laughs> what? You've gone soft. I'm sorry, my old friend, but the answer is no. I'm not coming back. And you should have stayed in Antiva. <laughs> yeah. We must not have got to surprise you. Oh. Seriously, already? <laughs> Have me not paying a blind wheel of attention again. Okay, that's got him. Talison is dead, and I am free of the crows. They will assume that I am dead along with Talison. So long as I do not make my presence known to them, they will not seek me out. Okay. A very good <laughs> thing. It is, in fact, what I had hoped for ever since you decided not to kill me. I have enjoyed our company, but I am wondering if it is not time for me to leave. That would be the practical thing to do, no? Yeah. There is a freedom yeah, awaiting me that I have never known. But I suppose the decision is yours. Will you let me go? Yeah. Do you? Mm. <laughs> I suppose there are worse things I could do with my time than save the world. Yeah. Mm. All right. You make a convincing argument. You do seem to stumble onto treasure on a regular basis somehow. <laughs> yeah. Let I us do. return to the task at hand then. There is still much to be done, yes? Mm. Okay, right. Ah, uh, where's the exit again? Ah. Uh. Did it bug out? <laughs> Great, but let me load.
Ah, fair we are. Okay then. It's begun. What I wanted to do, so let's head back. Okay, then let's go find this guy. Guy, okay. where is no Ali one? Ah, warden. I trust you've made yourself comfortable. Yes. Good, because it's likely to be your last rest for a while. This is Elena. She's. I am Queen Enora's handmaiden. She sent me here to ask for your help. Or perhaps the young lady prefers to speak for herself. <laughs> yeah, partly. Uh. The Queen. She is in a difficult position. She loved her husband, no? And trusted her father to protect him. When he returns with no king and only dark rumors, what is she to think? She worries, no? But when she tries to speak with him, he does not answer. He tells her not to trouble herself. Um... I... My queen suspects she cannot trust her father. And Logan, he is very subtle, no? But when and how, he is privy to all the secrets and not so subtle. So she goes to how? A visit from the queen to the new Isle of Denrum? It's only a matter of courtesy, and she demands answers. And I think he calls her every sort of name, tries her being the kindest, and locks her in a guest room. Uh, I think her life is in danger. I heard how say she would be a greater ally dead than alive, especially if her death could be blamed on Arl Eamon. Um. We may have no choice but to trust Anora. The Queen is well loved. If Loghain succeeded in pinning her death on me, I'm not sure that's a risk we can afford to take. Um, oh, I, I have some uniforms. I'll how hire so many new girls every day. A few more will not cause much stir. I will show you to the servants' entrance. We must slip in and out with my Queen before anyone is the wiser. I will go ahead to House Estate. Meet me there as soon as you can. Okay then. Let's go rescue the queen. It shall be done. Oh, indeed. Yes. Indeed. <sighs> anyway. So, we've got to go rescue the Queen. Fun!
anyway. Now I've got to go there. Take a while to load, isn't it? The servant's entrance is on the other side of the house. We must slip past this cloud to reach it. We will have to be very careful. Al how is inside. Okay. The estate is in poor repair. The new owl, he has not been very prompt in paying his workmen. Ah. I will be right behind you. Okay. No, not Miss Craft all has had enough of now. Someone's creeping around down there. Go check it out. More enemies ahead. The owl used to come here in the winter when I was small. I uh, slept with the hounds. I've <laughs> been warm. I can distract the guards, but you must move quickly. Okay. Polly, my lady does not have much time. Are you all prepared? I will go distract okay. the guards. I will lure them into the courtyard. Wait in the bushes. Oh, the That's the bushes. Oh, there. Oh, you must come! I saw something! A better fountain! I think it was a dark spawn! Dark spawn. They will drag us all underground <laughs> to be eaten. Oh, I'm trying to call for help. Mothers. Did you fall off a cart full of stupid? Call for help so they can see us act like scared little girls because of some knife eared wench. They will eat us all alive. Please get help. If there is something out there and we don't sound the alarm, we'll look worse than scared. And dress these holy knickers. Fine, we'll <laughs> check the courtyard if it'll keep you from wetting yourself. But there's nothing there. Thank you. Oh, it was over here. Quickly. Okay, let's go. Okay, then. Ah, oh, it took me forever to be rid of those two. You must be careful now. The servants, they will not look closely at anyone in uniform. All guards are alike to a cook, no? But you should not draw attention to yourself. Most of the guards are new. They will not know you for a stranger at a glance. It is best you keep your distance from all of them and try to blend in. Okay. She's in the guest room of the main hall. Andra, stay guide us. 
This kitchen is a disgrace. How did the old, old servant do the cooking? No one ever said the Kendalls had any sense. I say how what the level of it is a new one. He'd have to knock down every place he owns it. <laughs> Three nights in a row. For all we know, it's not much. How's too cheap to buy it? Cook's probably roasting the elves that broke it. get back from high ever. Not in the tongue of all the nations of the world made to make Warden is here, my lady. Thank the Maker. I would greet you properly, but I'm afraid we've had a setback. Eh. Yes, about that. My host was not content with leaving me under heavy guard. He sealed the door by magic. Mm. Find the mage who cast the spell. He'll most likely be at house side. Fun. Thank you, Warden. My prayers go with you. Tern Howe will probably be in his rooms. They're at the end of the hall, on the left. Okay. Come on, go there. Well. Door. I think. Oh, right, over there. Begun. What? Who goes there? Oof. Thank you for creating such distraction, stranger. I have been waiting days for the opportunity. Have you? Do you think you could... Alistair? Is that you? Who... Wait. I do know you. You were at my joining. He's one of us. A warden from Orlais. Jada, I think. Or was it Monsumar? I'm afraid I don't remember your name. Amri Orden, senior warden of Jada. But born and bred in Hyever, and glad to be home. Uh, what are you doing here? For the most part, attempting to hold my tongue. I was sent when we received no word from King Kaelin as to the outcome at Ostagar. The king had invited all the wardens of Orlay and their support troops to join him. Then nothing. Uh, we had 200 wardens and two dozen divisions of cavalry. The first we heard of Logain's edict was when everyone was turned back at the border. That was when the rumor reached us that wardens were being blamed for the massacre. We finally decided it was safest to send someone alone to learn how best to fight the Blight and this regime simultaneously. As a native Ferelden, I volunteered to make the crossing. Yeah. The other wardens won't risk their strength fighting Ferelden's civil war. If they spend themselves against Logain, there is truly no hope. 
They recall accounts of the first blight, how many cities fell. If Ferelden is too foolish to save itself, at least, we'll be ready when the Archdemon leads its forces further. Besides, I hear you haven't been doing badly at raising an army yourself. But perhaps if the edict can be lifted, I will send a message as soon as we are gone from this place. Um... With an offer of hospitality and a poison chalice. I was fool enough to think Loghain didn't yet know who I was. Okay, where is he? I saw him going to the dungeons. He may still be there. Okay. I wouldn't be much use to you in my current condition. And if you'll pardon me, I have a sudden desire to breathe some free air. I will seek you out later. After I find a good physician. Yeah, he did and that. Good luck, brother. Okay, got to head down to the dungeons now. I went the wrong way again, didn't I? Oh, great for our enemies. Who goes? Anybody tries to come in here without Howl's say so, we get to do what we like with them. I think we finally got a bit of entertainment here, lads. Fun. Yeah, right ahead. Great. When did that happen? <laughs>
wrong one. I'm here. Okay, well, let's move on. I shall do it. Uh, I guess I've got to go this way. Makes sense. We're going to go the long way round. on Well... Maker, oh maker. 
sounding the horns for retreat. Do you hear it? Oh. Very well. Ah, uh, okay. Now I'm gonna look for doors. They said to retreat. The horn sounded, and we turned, and then the screams. We rode, and they screamed, and screamed, and... Oof. <sighs> Mother, can you smell the blood? They said it was only darkspawn. But we ate them, too. Oof. They died, and we left them. In the swamp. The witch. The witch! He's obviously mad. I don't think you'll get anything more out of him. Okay. Safe? Is there a safe? Perhaps next door? Uh. What month is it? Are you some enemy of our Urians? Please, I feel like I've spent half my life down here. Um. Dead. Then who's ruling? His son, Vaughn. He struck me down and I woke up here. People were so angry, they, they were thinking of petitioning the king. Um. There have been many changes since they caught me. I need to find out what happened. I need to get home or flee the city. I I thank you for your aid, stranger. I wish I had more than gratitude to offer. Okay. supposed to be a lesson did my father think it funny to leave me for so long before sending you uh. <laughs> you move in august company stranger i am oswin son of ban sigard of the dragon's peak banner if you aren't one of our soldiers pray tell me who should i be thanking i'm hurry <laughs> then i have no question about why you would come warden for it is your men who have suffered the most here you have my heartfelt gratitude. And I assume the gratitude of the entire Dragon's Peak Banner. If my father sent no one after me, I can only assume that he does not yet know the true colors of the snakes he is allied with. But if you talk to him, I'm certain he would offer you any reward you might ask. Um. Then there is a lands meet after all. How said the Earl of Rickliffe was dead, and the lands meet called off? He I swear, it. if there be any forum to speak out against Loghain, my father will be there. Now, please, I must try to get to him. I cannot see the last of this place too soon. Okay, that's that bit done. Yeah, we'll pose for later.
Very well. Allow me. I could do that for you. Uh. I shall do it. Well, well, the Grey Warden. I must say I'm surprised Eamon would condone you invading my castle and murdering my men. Is he losing faith in the persuasive powers of his land's meat? Uh... You should have left when you had the chance, Warden. Slunk off to the Andervels to hide with the rest of your kind. This landsmeet is a farce. Logain will triumph no, and if I can help it. will die. No, if I can help it. Make it have mercy on his begun. Make it have mercy on your faithful servant. Uh. <laughs> now I can see I can open these doors now. Hmm. Who's there? Stay away. You can't do this to me. I'll have you all flayed. I'm the Arl of Denerim. Um. I'm Vaughn Kendall's, heir to the Arling of Denerim, it's true. Too many of our troops were lost at Ostagar. When the riots started, Howe came with men to reinforce the garrison here. Or that's what he claimed. As soon as I let him into the palace, he threw me in here. One more victim of the Elven uprising, he said. Let me out of here. I'll do anything. Um. Stay here. What? <laughs> Come back! When I get out of here, I'll find you, you bastard. Andraste, Bride of the Maker, have mercy on me. I'll stand away. Is that you, little sister? No, I, I don't know you, do I? Are you real? Yes. I'm starving. I, I don't know. Where is my sister? Have you seen her? 
I, uh, I'm Erminric, Knight Lieutenant of the Denrim Chantry. You aren't one of the Tales men? Nope. It sounds like he's in Lyrium withdrawal. He's got all the signs, confusion, weepiness. He probably doesn't even know what he's saying. If the Grand Cleric knew he were in here, she'd be spitting hot coals. Nobles don't have authority over Templars. I... Uh, I failed in my duties. Make you... Forgive me. I failed. And there's no telling what he's done. Mm, you're a Templar. Alf Stanner is... Uh, a far better man than I would have been, but I... I don't remember how I came to be here. The Malefica. He had turned blood magic upon Templars and Circle Mages to escape from his tower. Near Redcliffe, I cornered him. But the Thames men took him from me. And brought me Oof. here. Sounds like Joan. Yes. He destroyed his phylactery. We were spread out, trying to find him. I was alone. I... You are real, aren't you? My dreams are so strange now. Please, if you're not a dream, help me. Okay. No one can free me from failure, save blessed Andraste. Okay. Give this ring to my sister, Alstana. Tell her. Tell her I'm sorry. Please, ask her to pray for me. Okay, then. Let's go back upstairs. Anyway, that sets a few things up for the landsmeet.
have dropped on me there. Okay, then. Am I going the right way? No. I don't think so, anyway. Um, that. My thanks. <laughs> Let's go. Thank you. I'll trust you to lead us safely out. If house people find me, I'll be killed. And my people will insist on escorting me back to the palace, where my father may also have me killed. <laughs> Warden. In the name of the Regent, I am placing you under arrest for the murder of Rendon Howe and his men-at-arms. Surrender, and you may be shown mercy. Yeah. Bring them down! Loghain wants the Warden, dead or alive. <laughs> More enemies ahead. I should probably shouldn't have that fat, but... Demon, we have a problem. Andraste, watch over our friends in danger. Calm down. What has happened? The Wardens have been captured. What? How could this happen? Never mind that. The question is, how to free him? Surely you mean them, Your Highness. We need Alistair too. Yes, of course, I meant Alistair too. I know where they are. The Grey Warden is in possession of a ring that allows me to locate him. Getting to him, however, is quite something else. Okay, from that, really did not go well. I've been thrown in the dungeons. Oh, you're awake. I was starting to worry. Uh. Mm. <laughs> Join the Grey Wardens. See the sights from the floors of the best prisons in the land. 
It's not much of a recruitment slogan, is it? Nope. I hope you have a plan. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, I think I shall end this episode here, and I'll be seeing you next time.